Hi, I'm Scott Steinberg, and today I'm going to go over some antivirus basics. Malware is malicious software that has been specifically designed to attack a computer system. The first thing that comes to mind for most people is a virus. A virus is a self-replicating, self-installing computer program that can spread like a human cold. It keeps your computer from working at 100%. Beyond viruses, there are also many other types of malware. Adware is advertising supported software that plays, displays, or downloads advertising content to your computer. These often show themselves in the form of pop-ups or banners. You have to be careful though, because some adware can be unknowingly activated when you try to install legitimate applications with which the adware is bundled. This adware can lead you to install additional malicious software or even lead you to pages that are infected. Phishing is a cybercrime tactic that involves baiting victims in order to steal money, personal information, or transmit malware. It's often seen in the form of strange links, unexpected messages, and phony sites. Phishing is often designed to separate people from their money. It can be hard to spot and easy to overlook, but phishing can result in viruses and serious computer problems for those who fall for its tricks. Most dangerously, phishing is a common method of identity theft. To safeguard against phishing attacks, you should install additional software with anti-phishing protection to secure your personal information. Here are some warning signs that your computer is infected with malware. Your internet browser might freeze, hang, or become unresponsive. You may experience excessive pop-ups and messages, and the appearance of unwanted toolbars at the top of your browser. Your computer might run slower than usual, freeze, or shut down unexpectedly. You may also see new icons on your desktop or unusual error messages and be unable to access key system functions. If you discover that your computer is infected, follow these simple steps. First, back up your important files. Then you'll want to use a tool to remove infections and repair some of the issues caused by the malicious software. Now, if you're still seeing problems, run a computer scan. There are a few great free antivirus scanners available online. This scan will help clean out your system, and best of all, it's free. Now, your system should be back to operating normally and free of malware. But how do you protect yourself in the long run so you're not in this position again? Simple. Think before you click and install an antivirus software on your computer. And hopefully this knowledge has been helpful. This is Scott Steinberg, signing off.